Welcome back to Phoenix Point, folks. At the end of the last episode, we got ambushed, so we're dealing with that now. And we can see three enemies right off the bat. So, uh, what do you have? You have a machine gun and an organic launcher arm, but not that many hit points, so that's nice. Okay, what do you have? You have Pain Chameleon. Alright. So... What about you? How about you dash up here? And... then you... Quick aim. And fire your weapon at this guy and take out his pink chameleon ability. Gotcha. Torso disabled. And then you can quick aim again. And I actually think I want to take out this guy. That was a kill. Because I want to make sure that he's dead. Now you can More fire twice at this guy. He can't pink chameleon now. Let's shoot at the arm. And shoot at the face. He's down. Did he drop anything for us? No, unfortunately not. And there's this guy. Now, we have... Ooh, we have a shotgun there. Don't we have a... Oh, there you are. You can dash twice. Is that enough that you can make it over there and whack him? I think it is. Let's do it. There's another one. And another one of those things. Okay. Dash again. Uh, dash in Never here and smack him twice. Oh, okay, smack him once, and then you can run away as far as way as you can from that uh, thing. Right, then we have you. Now, if you. I actually want you to dash over here. Well, there you can only see that guy. What about... How about coming up here? Dash for here. Ready to fire. Take that thing out. It's dead, right? Yeah, it's dead. So then we have our shotgun dude. He can dash up. And get right in the face of this guy. And hopefully take him out. He didn't die. But we disabled pretty much everything. And he's bleeding for 30, so he's going to bleed out. Alright, that means that you can come back here and take some cover. You could take a shot, but why not? Uh, there's nothing up top for you, unfortunately. So let's just come back here. And then we have you. You can overwatch in some direction. Though I think we have taken out. No, we haven't. Alright. So you... Shoot at this guy. He's gonna pain chameleon. 
that's okay. And then come back so you're not so exposed. Can you move anywhere? No. Can you move anywhere? No. The only one who can move anywhere is this guy. And... I don't really want him to move anywhere, I think. Actually, I do. Come back here. And in the turn. Those guys are dead. You. you can't dash anymore, so that's not going to work. In that case, why don't you come over here and take out his in-community track. He's bleeding for 60 now. No, he's been in for 10 only. Okay, we need another shot on him. Acquiring target. He's down. Alright. Switch to the pistol and overwatch in this direction. You overwatch in this direction. Ooh, he dropped something. Let's go get it. Nice. A bulldog. I'll take that. And move back in cover. Did this guy drop something? Nah. Alright. You overwatch over in this direction. And you can... Overwatch in this direction. Now, I think I want the hammer guy to come back a bit Dash around ahead. the center. Because we don't know where our extraction point is, and I don't want him to be far away from everyone else. And this guy needs to come back a bit as well. Moving you to come back here and overwatch uh, over here. I got this covered. You can stay right there and overwatch this direction. You can you know what come over here and overwatch in that direction you can just move into the middle and you can overwatch down here and there's you, you can come back here and overwatch over this way there we go we've survived three turns, now we just need to evacuate Come some guys. Three of them. Now where is our extraction point? It's over there. Okay. That's actually not great. Let's come in this direction. And you can you can use a dash. I can do it. Well done. And then you can just run back here. Try dashing. All right. You. Come down here. Just want to get a f as far away as from those three guys as I can. 
because I really don't want them to get shots off for free. Channel open. Yeah. And the last guy. Five by five. Who can come down here? All right. All done. End the turn. Now just need to get out. No choice but to keep going. Quickly. Well, let's just uh, evacuate them immediately while well, we have them selected. As everyone is getting out on this turn. Evacuate. Sprinting to position. And evacuate. And evacuate. And ambush done. Very good. Ambush survived. Bit of XP, no level ups though, but that's fine. So let's head back to the Geoscape and see what's going on. All right, we did it and we actually recovered some useful stuff. So it wasn't a total waste going on the ambush there. Well, we didn't have a choice in going on the ambush really, but it wasn't a complete waste. All right, so before we uh, continue here on the Geoscape, I just want to mention that uh, on the 21st and 22nd of December, my girlfriend and I are moving to a new apartment. So I won't be able to record that weekend and I am only able to record on weekends. So I will be recording well ahead so that I have basically have everything recorded up to and including, well, almost to New Year's. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, there will be a lot of advanced recording, but I think that's better than than getting uh, than not getting any videos out. So, just so you're aware, if I don't uh, react to your comments or change the way I'm doing things, if you have suggestions or something like that, it's because I have recorded in advance. But luckily, I have learned to use the uh, WASD keys or uh, panning around the screen. So hopefully that uh, annoyance is gone. Now, before we continue, let's have a look at our bases. We are building a fabrication facility, a research lab at base two. At base one, we have our three training facilities online. So that's very nice. And we should build the alien containment. Do we have that? We do have that, but we can't build it yet. Because we do not have the materials for it. We are very low on materials. So let's see, we have a scan going here. We have a scan going here, which is almost done. So let's Head up here and do this for this area. Scan complete. There we go, the scan is complete. Phoenix base discovered! Nice! You have located a Phoenix base and brought it and brought it back online. Nice! I like it. So there's living quarters, a store. Vehicle bay. There's a medical bay here. And there's no Oh, there is an energy generator. We can't really afford to do anything with this base right now. But it's very nice that we have it. Very nice that we have it. We have a base here. We have a base up here. And where's our third base? I forget. One. Two. Where's the third base? 
This one. Where the heck is it? There's one there. There's one there, and there's one there. Right, these two are kind of close together. That's okay. Right, let's over here, head over here and explore this site. Scavenging site. We could really use some materials, so we are going on the scavenging mission. So, see you in a sec. Alright, here we go. Here we go. So, what do we have? What do we have? We don't see anyone anywhere. Uh, let's see, we have ooh, a lot of materials here. Five, six materials right in this area. Materials over there. Some tech. So, what we really want to protect is our materials. So, we're going to hang out in uh, around this area, I think. Let's come forward and scout a bit. Nothing to see there. What's their plan? Now, I'd very much like to see them as soon as possible, so that we can do something about them. Let's actually. Hmm. Let's come up here in the high cover. Probably, oh, there's a couple. They're over here. What do you have? You have pincer and launcher. Okay. Receiving okay. loud and clear. Now, I wonder if he can actually get a shot down there. Let's come up this way. And you will come up this way as well. You might have a shot here. Let's see if you do. You do, actually. Hmm. Let's go for the arm. Nice. Right, now you... Come this way and see if there's anything up here. We didn't see anything. We will send three this way as well. Try and cover as much territory as we can. Receiving loud and clear. You might as well move up too. Alright, on the turn. That guy's bleeding. He still has his launcher. Kinda sucks. Ooh, there's a little minefragger there. We don't like those. We really don't like those. No, we don't see anything up this way, which is kind of surprising and a little bit disconcerting. Uh, Alright, so snipes. You can get two shocks off if you quick aim. Let's first see. You can't actually see anything here, even though it says so. No, it doesn't say so. It doesn't say so. That's the way to speak English. It doesn't say so. Alright, so you can only get one shot off. Uh, let's come over here. And let's just take this guy out. He has a lot of armor. But it shouldn't really matter too much. He's dead. Alright, then we have you. He could come up and dash. Or uh, dash up and bash this guy. And this guy Holmes could dash him. up. So let's dash. And dash again in here. 
where he can see both of them. And then we will fire at you. That thing's dead. And then we will fire at you. Uh, take out your leg, I think. Yeah. Alright. And then we have... Felix. Gotta keep going. Who can come up here? Uh, can he get all the way he can? Let's come over to this side. Let's smack him. There we go. He's gone. And he can actually just stay there. That's pretty good cover he has. Right. So, where else do we have some? Because they aren't attacking anything. So it's kind of hard to know where they are. Let's come up this way. No sight of anything. Then let's come up a bit further. Repositioning, up there. prioritizing speed. Nothing. Nothing. All right. Then I think we'll come in here and take a look. Still nothing. All right. And I suppose you can come up here. And we'll end the turn there. Oh, where? There. Over there. Okay. So he is probably standing out there. Receiving loud and clear. Now, where's our shotgun guy? He's right here. Let's dash in with you. There we go. Hello there. Whoa. Uh, let's actually dash over to this side. And you can take two shots. Whoa. Take out the leg. Oh, he's dead. And that's the mission. All crates saved. Very nice. And a couple of level ups for ooh, for uh, our melee guy and for Hamish for gnomes. So very cool. Very cool. All right, let's head back to the geoscape. All right, so 100 uh, tech 700 materials, that is good, and 100 food, and some arrow quiver, and a cipher handgun, not too interesting, but every little bit helps, every little bit helps. I think I want to come up here and do a scan. Or actually, maybe just come up here and do a scan. Hmm. Let's head up there. Do a scan up there. I don't think I've already done what done one, so uh, let's area scan. Now we do have our materials here, so let's go to bases. We'll repair that. We'll repair that. And since there's a medical bay here, maybe we should build a training center as well. 
I'm not really sure though. What we could do is hire someone. We can find someone who is interesting to hire. What are you? You're a melee guy, so let's see. We have. We already have a second melee guy who's already level 4. That's pretty sweet. So. Hmm. Let's level up these guys. Training. Blood loss, damage, and speed are increased proportional to the health lost. Double. Might be good, but it might also not be good. I'm ready for action. Don't really need it. I think we're gonna give you some speed and some help. And then we're going to get the reckless thing. And the adrenaline rush. So let's... I'd actually really like to give you some willpower as well. We'll get a bit of that there. Alright. So now we can do three dashes. Which is pretty sweet. Alright. Let's go back and grab Hamish. Training. Hamish is our shotgun dude right now. So... We could actually do Reckless, because he will be in their face. He will be in their face. Hmm. Could also give him heavier sniper. I don't think I want to do that. We're gonna grab Reckless. And then we're going to get a bit more speed. And a bit more willpower. Actually, we'll do like that. Get the strength up a little bit more. Right. Then we have these guys. Uh, do I want to do anything with these as of yet? You know what? We'll leave it until... Until we actually get to it. Uh, to, to have another craft. But we do have some sites to explore up here, so let's go ahead and do that. We also have Frozen up there. We also have this uh, base down here, the nest, which maybe we should do. There's a lot of stuff to do. There's some mist here as well. Let's actually see, where is there mist? There's a lot of mist over here in um, Central America. Africa is completely clear of mist, and so is Europe. Right, so maybe we should... Once this scan is done, I think I'll start a scan up here and start moving across to the Americas. Let's go ahead and explore this site. There. Fort Churchill is a haven run by New Jericho. We finally found a New Jericho haven. All right, Fort Churchill is a haven run by New Jericho, which means that normally things are quiet and under control, but right now there is an emergency. A group of soldiers is on a killing spree. It began with strange dreams, voices heard in the night. A local doctor tells our operatives. I could not detect any physiological changes and there, and there were certainly no signs of infection but their behavior simply cannot be explained by PTSD or similar conditions, which we at New Jericho are sadly quite familiar with. It's like something has driven them mad. If we stop these soldiers, New Jericho will undoubtedly be grateful to us. Let's start this mission. Everyone is basically fine. Everyone has what they need. Uh, let's have a quick look at the equipment just to see what we have. We have a grenade there. We have a couple of grenades there. We have a couple of grenades there. We have a couple of grenades there. There. 
And there we have incendiary grenades. Alright, so I think we're good to go. Let's head out. Alright, in we go. In we go. Let's do this. Okay, we can see someone up there. I'm, I'm actually thinking uh, tossing a grenade might be a good thing right off the bat. Now, I'm guessing they're in here, most of them. Let's see, you have a grenade. Can you toss that up there? You can. Doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but it does some. Let's get into cover of some sort, at least. Actually, let's get in here. Receiving loud and clear. Right. Uh, you, if you come back, can you then see him? You can. Heading That's out. Not bad. Targeting. That has twenty-three armor. Also has 21. Taking out his head would be really good. You're gonna get it nice. now. How the heck? That was that was from far away that that thing uh, triggered, in my opinion. Right. Let's see you. You have pretty good strength. So let's come up here and yes. toss a grenade up there and take him out. That's one of them dealt with. And then come over for cover here. Now our shotgun guy I think I want to send him in this way together with our melee guy. Ooh, there's a there's a dude. We can't see him though, or we can't shoot at him. We could dash in and take a shot. I think I'd rather. What's our plan? Our melee guy is already done. Hmm. You know what? Let's dash in here. Dash into the corner. And I think we'll take out his arm. We'll shoot right here. He did. Nice. Right, can you come up here and overwatch this door? And then you can come this way, and I want my sniper out this way as well. We'll watch in this general direction. In the turn. Watch this. Hey, another guy up top. That's not great. Where can we get up top? Only from in here, I guess. There's a. Is there a ladder in here? There's a ladder there. Damn it. So, Receiving. let's just Absolutely. see. No, we, we, we can't get up top. Alright. And I want to get up top because I want that equipment that he dropped. Now we have a guy there. We have a guy up top. So... When you have a dash left in you... Ooh, they're 
Uh, there's just one guy in there. Now, I wonder if this guy is on Overwatch. I suppose we're gonna find out. As we're gonna head over here. Hello. How you doing? <laughs> I love it. It is so awesome. Now, you can come back here. Pick this stuff up. And get in cover. So you... Let's overwatch you on this door again. There. And there's snipes who we really just have to run as far as we can with. Receiving loud and clear. And you'll Let's come up this. here. And overwatch in this direction. You'll come. Hmm. Well, you won't have much cover, but overwatch in this general direction. Covering. And then there's you. I want you to come in here. Those quarters combat is just your thing. And this is the overwatch on the turn. Took some damage. That's fine, I guess. He's still there. Five by five. Let's smack him in the face, shall we? Ash. Got Over here, and we'll smack him twice. Right. Oh, okay, we'll st strike him once, and that was the mission. All right, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Very cool. Hamish was doing most of the work. Very nice. Let's head back to the Geoscape. I had always assumed the Phoenix Project would return one day, even after Symes disappeared. It seems to be the defining pattern of your history fall, then rise again. I wonder if this points to an underlying weakness or an underlying strength. I suppose time will have to tell. Time and the choices you make. After all, you are not necessarily defined by what has come before. You can be whatever your will allows you to be. That is the essence of the human experience. That is very true, Tobias. What happened to those soldiers was disturbing. I agree, it was. That is why I did not intervene. We could have stopped those soldiers ourselves easily enough. But I needed you to see, to understand that far more is at stake here than just our ecosystem or our genetic purity. We are being robbed of what makes us human, our will. I fear neither the Utopians at Sinedrian or those Anu fanatics really understand that. If you can recognize the real nature of the threat, perhaps we can work together on stopping it. Perhaps, perhaps. It was disturbing. So, Nujerico's attitude to us plus four and six hundred materials. Just what we needed. Beautiful. And we have found a new Jericho Haven. So we could actually trade for even more. Two to ten. You know what? I'm gonna trade everything. There. So that takes us up to 1465 materials. That is awesome. And in the next episode, we will find out how we're going to spend those. 
So three missions on this one, ambush, scavenge, and the new Jericho mission. Actually, before we end, let's just take a quick look at diplomacy because now we've met everyone. So we're reasonably friendly with new Jericho, reasonably with Sunidrian as well, a little bit with both of them, but very friendly with the, the disciples of Anu, who are also the biggest, uh, um, the, the biggest faction so that's a little bit interesting but um yeah we will see what goes down in the future in the next episode guys so thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you next time